We are really happy to be joined today by David Nower. Um, perhaps you could start off today by telling us a little bit about yourself and about your connection to Aspen, Germany. Yeah, so my name is David Nower, and uh, I've been with the Aspen Institute for several years on the Coratorium. I was introduced to it uh, many, many years ago and loved the program and wanted to get more involved, and uh, here we are. Well, and so you already mentioned, you know, that you love the program. I guess maybe you can uh, help explain a little bit about what Aspen means to you in your own words. You know, I'm, I'm very involved with a lot of things that are American, German uh, here. So I'm on several different boards, and everybody has their own specialty. So you have American Chamber of Commerce, which is business. You have Atlantic Broker, which is more political. And at Aspen, it's more about policy. It's... Uh, a, a group of very diverse people that get together to talk about the critical issues of the day and how we can work together to, to solve some of those issues. Uh, and there are plenty to be solved today. So that's one of the things that I really like about Aspen, that, which is different uh, from others, uh, this niche of really looking at policies and how can we help and make the world a better place. Yeah, and I think you pick up, too, there a lot on, you know, our role as a convening platform. So it's not just, you know, about, uh, you know, having people of a certain level or of a certain background come together, but about bringing people with diverse perspectives together. Maybe you can highlight a specific program or a specific uh, event or something along um, during that has happened during your time as an affiliate of Aspen um, and, and reflect on that about one of your favorites. So certainly my favorite was something that uh, I almost didn't do because it was so much work ahead of time, but the philosophy and leadership uh, program that uh, Aspen has. And I've, I met so many people at that conference. It was a weekend, a long weekend. Um, a lot of the people that I met that day have become very good friends and are still friends today. And it was just an amazing weekend. It gives you the, the opportunity to think about leadership very different from what you learned when you got your MBA. Uh, just looking at it through the, through the glasses of some famous philosophers philosophers and, and great thinkers of our time and, and, and times before. And it's, uh, it's a wonderful program that I've been supporting and I continue to support. Thank you. I think that's one that comes up a lot as a highlight from, uh, yeah, the leadership seminar is definitely one of those that pulls all of the Aspen, uh, Aspen goals and, and values together. Um, maybe as just a final question, looking ahead, this is obviously our 50th uh, birthday this year. Um, it's hard to believe, but Aspen Germany has been around for that long. Um, what are you looking forward to for the future of Aspen beyond uh, year 50? Well, I think one of the important things is uh, that Aspen continue to do what they do. Uh, the the uh, core beliefs uh, of, of Aspen, which talk about, you know, competence and excellence and, and kindness and uh, integrity, the opportunity to be able to talk about issues in a forum where you know, in Germany, you have a lot of Trump bashing, so it, it, you get used to it. Uh, but here, in, because of the nonpartisan uh, and neutral uh, uh, way of looking at policy, you don't talk about the people, you talk about the policies. And I think that's something that's missing. I think that needs to be done more. And I think that Aspen has always been a great place to do that. And, and I look forward that, to that continuing. Thank you so much for being such a great supporter of Aspen Germany, and uh, thank you for being here.